There are around 200 billion stars in our galaxy. And tens of billions of those have planets that are kind of like Earth. So even if the odds of complex life occurring on an Earth-like planet are one in a billion, it's likely we're not alone. So where is everybody? Well, the galaxy is huge. It takes light 100,000 years just to make it from one edge to the other. And the fastest spaceships we can build would be lucky to reach even a tenth of a percent of the speed of light. So maybe the aliens just haven't arrived yet. But that's a little weird because the galaxy is really old. So old that even a slow-going alien civilization would have had plenty of time to colonize the whole thing. The first thing you need is a ship, or at least a robot, that can copy itself. Send two of those out to the nearest stars, and when they arrive, they'll set up shop and make two more copies each. Repeat this process for a while, and even if it takes hundreds of years to travel from one solar system to another, it would only take about 10 million years to colonize every solar system in the galaxy. Compared to the 13 billion years that our galaxy has been around, that's nothing. If technologically advanced aliens exist, there should be evidence of them everywhere. So why haven't we found it? Well, maybe aliens don't exist. Maybe life really is so rare that only one planet in a galaxy has it. Or maybe civilizations just can't develop advanced technology without destroying themselves. Or maybe aliens really are everywhere and we just don't know how to find or recognize them. And that just underscores how difficult the idea of alien life is. We have to make assumptions about what aliens would be like. Like maybe they're carbon-based, need liquid water, and use technology based on radio waves. Otherwise, what do we look for? But nothing says that aliens have to be anything like us or even like anything we can conceive of before we meet them. Which means if we assume too much, then we'll probably miss life that's truly alien. 